Well, Ralph and I met on the campus of Everett Community College. <laughs> so that was our first meeting of our educational minds. <laughs> yes. We support higher education because our belief that through education, there's a significant benefit to society. UW-Batho has become like a home for us. It's not just one thing that they've done, it's all the things that they've done. They give tremendous financial support, which is very important for the growth of our programs, but also they give their time. And they give their time through mentoring of students for guiding our capstone teams. And they help us understand the best way that we can run our capstone programs. It's a very hands-on uh, type of support that really our students benefit from. Having Ralph as a capstone mentor and advisor to the program is invaluable. In the sense of philanthropy, there's different ways you can do it. There's, shall we say, your treasure, your time, and also your talent. What do you bring to the table? Now, if you provide just one of those, that's certainly very honorable. But if you provide all three of those, think of it as a three-legged uh, stool. It provides the stability. That's why we do such a broad range of involvement here. Yes, this is a university, but it's a smaller, cozier, community-style campus. And it's just a, a closeness you feel. You're a part of something. The impact on the two of us through our association with Utah Bothell has been um, amazing. The more we got involved, the more we realized that we wanted to have something more, to have a fund that would perpetuate what we were trying to do and, and what we were trying to help the students achieve. Mm -hmm. We had some students that were going to actually have to step out of their studies for want of relatively small amount of money. And we just didn't feel that was right. To be able to use that endowment to help other students fulfill their dreams and their careers, um, it just, uh, it just, you know, gets us right here. Mentorship is incredibly important. These are students that they started the program, shall we say, deer in the headlights. <laughs> About 20 weeks later, they have become engineers. Mm -hmm. My first uh, capstone team, we still go out to dinner with them from time to time, help them through their career. It's been very enjoyable for us. The amount of time that they put in directly interacting with our students is just tremendous. What I find to be interesting is, is how well our students do in the job market when they're competing with students from much better known programs. And I think the reason is that our students are coming away with the soft skills that the Capstone program focuses on, that Ralph has imparted to these students. So I can give you a story of one of my, uh, my students. Uh, he was um, going for an interview, and I just said, you know, just be yourself, you'll be fine. About 45 minutes later, he calls, <laughs> he calls me again. He says, I got the job. And I thought, you know, that, that really goes to show what we brought to the table and actually helped him. It's really very fulfilling to be able to give back in that way. To be associated with the school that does so much for the students, and I think that just uh, really touched our hearts and keeps us pushing forward. 